What up, guys? M.A. checking in. You know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at M.A. underscore the artist and at War Games ABG. And I had recently just saw John Wick 3, and I must say that movie was amazing. Please forgive me for the shaking because I am driving. Um, Because, you know, got to pay these bills and this phone bill somewhere. We ain't getting no videos. You dig what I'm saying? But, yeah, so I want to go see John Wick 3, and I must say, man, I saw Endgame, and I loved Endgame. But to me, John Wick 3 was better than Endgame. That's just my own personal opinion. I know that's against the grain, and I don't care. And I loved Endgame. I mean, I loved Endgame. But John Wick, was it, it was a lot more gritty. Um, I feel like they got a little bit straight, uh, more straight to the point. Um, and it's, so, it's like, for me, man, it's so hard to give, like, a great review on this movie because to, it, it's like it it was so good the action it was so much action like it was crazy and and they making a four like so um let's give you a quick overview because i don't want to spoil the whole movie but if you haven't seen it right now you're definitely uh haven't seen it already you're definitely slipping but um if you've seen the last one at the end, he killed, uh, I don't even remember that dude, but he was on a high table, um, which pretty much the high table is like, uh, you could say like a council that runs like the Assassin's Guild. And if you break these rules, um, they come find you. And one of the rules was you cannot spill blood on the hotel uh, hotel floor. And there's different hotels. Uh, the the one where he killed the high table dude, which was definitely he slipped up because the dude was on a high table and it was on uh, continental grounds. Um, they was double on his head, um, but um, the dude let him go. Um, I forgot his name, man. I'm so bad with names, but the older guy uh, that runs the continental, he's the manager, not the black dude, but the manager. Um, he told he let uh, John Wick pretty much give him. He gave him like, if I remember correctly, like an hour head start. So it was five o'clock, and he had until uh, six to you know get himself right before um, you know the um, the contract went in place, which was like fourteen million for his head because he spilled blood on continental grounds, which you can't do, and that's pretty much the purpose of the high table. So the high table comes in and. Usually they will put a contract out if you did something, but they wouldn't. The high table wouldn't uh, get involved. There was something like serious, like how he broke the rules. And the rules that he broke was, like I just said, spilling blood on continental grounds, which you cannot do at all. So the high table came and was trying to, um, uh, you know, punish everybody who helped him in between. So, um, Lawrence Finsburne character helped him. So he got cut up seven times. Uh, it was this Russian lady that helped him. Um, that actually happened during the movie. She got her, her hands actually cut through, which was very gruesome scene. Um, and, um, and then what well, Holly Berry didn't get, um, caught up, but she helped him too. And I'm going to assume on the four on four that Holly Berry she's going to get bent up and then she's going to have to come help him right um that's what my that's my guess um what else what else what else what else what else what else I'm trying to get all the important information and details to my to you beautiful people because um because you really got to see it man it's like so much more you know with a review you know you, you know you just zooming past it versus like how like dope it really was um, and pretty much he was, uh, he doesn't want to, John Wood pretty much doesn't want to die because he wants to remember the, the, uh, remember his wife or whatever. So he goes, um, he looks for Holly Berry for help and he wants to meet to the, um, the, the, I guess the, the main person of the high table. I don't really know what the technical name for him would be, but the, we're just going to say the main person. So he goes, meets with him. And it was, and by my surprise, I thought it was gonna be like oh white dude. It was an Arab, so uh, it's this Arab cat in the desert, which I thought was kind of was different and dope at the same time, because like who would have expected that? Um, so he's like, yo, you know, look, we're we're we will let you come back if you pledge our loyalty to us. So he cuts his finger off and gives his wedding ring to the dude, 
And the job they has to do is he has to kill the manager of the uh, the Hotel Continental in New York. And he's like, man, I don't know if I want to do it. He goes back. He meets up with the dude. He's like, man, I can't do it. You know, we didn't been through so much. And in between all of this, I remember, remember I said Lawrence Fishburne got chopped up, well, cut seven times. And it looks like he gets what well, appears that he got killed. So remember that part. So they fight, fight, fight. Uh, so that he comes and he meets the Hotel Continental guy in New York. And he tell, he's like, yo, I can't kill you. So what we going to do? He's like, well, we're going to fight these people to the last. So the hot table sends out, you know, some of their best uh, people. And they have like a shootout, shootout in there. And, of course, John Wick kills everybody. And then the lady who's the, um, I don't want to say the enforcer, but I guess the word, their, their mouth um, come. Uh, she's like, yo, we're just going to have a parlay. Um, what, what can we do to resolve this? Old, the old cat was like, look, I just want my hotel. And she was like, well, what are we going to do about John Wick? He was like, I don't know. And he shoots John Wick off. Of a building, right? And the lady, she goes, she's like, okay, well, cool, we're gonna give it to you. But if John Wick is alive, we're coming back for you. So she goes downstairs and see that his body is not there. John Wick gets saved by um, Lawrence Fishburne people, and at the very end, they throw John Wick. He's beat up, you know, because he just got knocked off of a three-story building how he's alive he's a tough sob is all i can say but um you see lawrence fishburne still alive and the way he got sliced up you would have thought he wasn't making it but he made it and lawrence fishburne was like yo i'm pissed off are you pissed off and then it cut alma and john Wick was like yeah i'm pissed off and then it cut and you already know john Wick four is gonna be nasty this movie was definitely an a plus the action was a one you got to go see it. I'm probably going to go see it again. That's how good it was. Um, that definitely gets an A plus to me. For me, that was the best movie of the year so far. Um, so go see it. You tell me what you think in the comments. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MA underscore the artist and at WordGamesABG. I love you beautiful people, and I'll see y'all later. Thank you. I'm out.